Hello friends, it's me Faisalamania. In this video tutorial, we will configure the Firebase and online database app. We configure it into our app in MIT app in wanted to okay and we also in this tutorial learn how to how to you can connect here the AI companion that the app available in the play store and you can test your app live on it okay and we need to first visit this MIT app inventor 2 and you can see that here my profile stream at profile and here my YouTube channel and you need to visit the firebase firebase.com and click on enter and open this first URL and you need to sign in or sign up in firebase account i have already signed in you can see that here my email and my name and you need to go to the mit app inventor and start new project and name it as any just like i name it as firebase test and click on intro and it will open up a screen you can see that and now we just need a text box two text box we need and we just use this label as a space just remove it text and it's we can use it as a space and we just need to put up a more text box and it's width to fill parent both of it both are the because we need to full view of these both text boxes and we just need to put up a button and its name is sent yeah, it's we can use this button to send the information to the firebase database okay you will clearly notify when we do an example on it and we need a label level one and we just need a button button two and name it as retrieve because this button we use to retrieve the data from the firebase okay basically our tutorial is about how to send how to configure firebase into our app and how to send and retrieve data from the firebase database and we just need to go back to design here we are on design and click on here experimental and drag and drop this firebase and click on it if it show a warning and click on ok and we will add the firebase extension in our app okay now we need to configure means set the firebase database link to it mit app in wanted to okay so just go to firebase and it's purely create a new firebase database and it will also learn you about how to make a new firebase database account okay and link it to mit app inventor and any android app okay let's go click on get started and it will open up loading sometime and these are my all projects so you just forgot about it and you seems and uh, you find nothing and you will only find the uh, add project because in past you can now know any project so just click on add project and name it as any of it mit just like mit and uh, at least four characters mit app okay 
now we just need to hear our country my country is pakistan so i choose the pakistan you can choose your own country and click on i accept to accept these all terms and condition you can also read out these all conditions and click on create project just wait for some time and it will load up and create your awesome project so we go on the MIT app in one try and click on firebase and you can see that here we remove it all and also it remove it and mm, here you didn't remove it and here our project is created now click on continue and it will open up like screen and get started here. and you can click must click on add firebase to your android app and here just your app just like com dot any of your app just like we create here the name is firebase just copy it and you can also copy it in control plus c you can use control plus c copy it and here you can control v to paste it okay now click on register app and click on next also on next and skip this step okay stick skip and now we need to go this arrow this setting button and project settings okay now it will open up a project settings of our database and here you find your web api key. just copy it copy and paste it on the firebase token control v here and we just need to firebase url go to a database and here you find two types of database a cloud database or run real-time database cloud database is also used offline and real-time database is must use online it give you real-time data to retrieve and sending so we use real-time database get started and start in test mode click on enable and here you find your url and you can copy it copy and paste it here control v and now we all configure and connect link our app to the firebase database now we need to do some our work on the block section and here you can see that here our database is null and you can also change the rules be sure that it's read and write be in both are the true and you can also change it and here to publish it and data you can see that here our null data and we will add data online by our app so just focus on it we need to when button one click okay when button one click firebase database error extension store value where the store value block here store value tag our tag is you can see that here this is our tag just rename it as tag text and you can also rename it as value text because we use our tag for our database and a value to store in our database so just text box one text you can also and change it as text and duplicate it duplicate it and here you can change it to the value text we store the value successfully and now we need to retry the data just we need to check it as is it work or not we just need to go to the 
here you can see that my mobile screen and you just need to go to a play store and click on MIT app inventor emulator and you can see that I have already installed it and you click on open and here MIT app inventor on this to you to you need to click on connect and AI companion and you can also see that here uh, you can see that you are stuck on the screen I just re refresh it um, refresh it and you can see that here start screen cast so I cast screen and I will notify you here you can see that I might have inventory you need to copy this code and you write on the here you can see that our we are connected and write on here what is tfh t t f h and g o d g o d you can also use a scan qr code to scan this qr code or you can also use this code and click on connect with code wait for some time it will show error just click on dismiss because we didn't develop the app fully so it will show the error now we need to check whether it sent data to a firebase or not just click here the hello utopian high mode and value high mode and click on here you can see that our empathy database and here our screencast and click on i click on send and just you can see that it's add the value and the tag you can also check it as on the plus option high mode here the tag hello utopian high mode is the value okay it's really good now try another and we just need to remove it and say hello say hello hi okay just back it and hi click on send and we just check the here you can see that say hello and hi okay very nice now we need to retry the data on that text left here you can see that we retry the data here text for label to now we work on the retry button and you need to go to the MIT app in one section and here you can see that here the option of button 2 and firebase database when got value when go to value text and here you can see there are level set level 1 text to level 1 we just use two levels we just check it out one level and here the level yeah here the space level space just name it as space and here you can see that space not it's a level 2 and it's we change it to text uh, when five based one database one got value successfully got value it's in a text and level two two and tag of value value we just need to value uh, here you can see that when click on it it will show up and we just connect it here value and when the button to click got focus now button to click five way database here you can see that get value get value tag our tag what tag it's uh, about this tag text tag text text okay and store it as on the set level text to here it's work as it is these suggestions are 
for your work and it will work as it is up to down okay when button one is stored a value in button two it retrieve and set the level to the get value okay now go to the our screencast and just unlock it and refresh and so just check it as and name it as here we just write a new tag just name it as tag and tag sorry tag and value is value and click on send just check it as it is send or not yes it is send tag value now if we click on retry button it must level to set to the value because we set here the level to text to get value and get value tag text box one and we write on a text box one is tag tag we write tag on a text box one so just click on retry and you can see that it successfully set the level to the our value so this is all you can also change the design according to yours and make the value well and it is the basic concepts about the firebase database we will continue work on login app in our next tutorial so that's all for today thanks for watching